Every year, 1.7 million people visit Custer State Park. I would guess the vast majority of you out there are part of that number. If you aren't part of that number, shame on you. The park is a haven for wildlife, a great place to look around, and is home to the world's biggest publicly owned buffalo herd. For generations, Custer State Park has been a place to make memories, a place of great spirit, and a place where the buffalo roam. But you already knew all of that. There are big changes coming to Custer State Park. In 2015, we will break ground for a new visitor center. Located near the Game Lodge, it will be in a perfect location for visitors to get oriented, inspired, and energized to explore the park. The center will engage and excite visitors, motivating them to stay longer and explore all the Black Hills have to offer. An interactive map will allow visitors to find the buffalo herd's locations, a climbing wall will challenge visitors to reach for the stars, and exhibits featuring nature's playground will depict recreational and scenic attractions to experience. Just as the bison are the centerpiece for the park, they will anchor the world-class introductory film showing the visitor center theater. The film will provide visitors with an epic feel of the park. Another exciting initiative, Senate Bill 50, is an opportunity to continue upgrading and improving the resorts and infrastructure that serve visitors to Custer State Park. A master plan for improvements at the four resorts in Custer State Park was completed in 2014. Senate Bill 50 will allow the Department of Game, Fish, and Parks the opportunity to begin making $11 million worth of improvements at the resorts later this year. Projects such as replacing and upgrading existing cabins to meet today's travelers' expectations, preserving the historic rock work and facade at the Game Lodge, replacing the Legion Lake Store, and much improved facilities and upgrading infrastructure to ensure that Custer State Park continues to draw visitors for generations to come are just a few examples of the planned improvements. All of the resort improvements will be paid for through franchise fees paid by the Custer State Park Resort Concessionaire and help ensure that Custer State Park continues as a premier destination that draws travelers from around the world. Help Custer State Park continue to provide memories for generations to come. Oh yeah, we have the 50th anniversary of the Buffalo Roundup this year and the Arts Festival will begin on the Thursday before the Roundup. 2015 in Custer State Park. We'll see you there.